Welcome today, this month of February, for some of you around the world, you were born in this month, you're celebrating your birthday. I have good news for you. Did you know that God has anointed me and ordained me to pray and receive answers to my prayers? And this is the reason why I want to pray for you, those of you especially born this month. Let me read something to you from the scriptures. In the book of John chapter 15, verse 16, the Bible writes and tells us, according to the King James Version, You have not chosen me, but I have chosen you, wow. and ordained you that you should go forth and bring forth fruit, and that your fruit should remain, that whatsoever you shall ask me in the name of my Father, that may I give unto you. Brethren, Christians all over the world, Born in this month of February, I have here, for example, a few names of those who are born in the month of February that are members of the Spirit Life International Church. But I don't want to limit this blessing, this special blessing from the presence of God to them alone. I want to use them as a point of contact to those of you around the world. Are you sick? Are you in pain? Are you challenged? Is there trouble? Are you wondering whether your dreams shall come true in this world? Are you challenged by the difficulties you have gone through? Are you born to a family without opportunities and, and the future is bleak for you? Hear me today as I pray for you. That will change. Join me right now. Stretch forth your hand. Whether you're watching me on the internet, in your room, in your car, on your device, on your telephone. It doesn't matter. Just connect with me right now in prayer as I release the power of God over you. And so, Father, in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, I pray for everyone who is under the influence of my voice right now. I pray that your hand comes upon them, that their destinies are changed. I pray that every opportunity in their life that has been limited today, this month that they are born, this month that marks the day of their birth, I celebrate with them. But I decree and I declare that every stumbling block on their way is removed. And every delay on their path is changed. Every limitation on their journey in life, Lord, is reversed. And I release the power, the anointing of God that transforms, the anointing of God that delivers, the anointing of God that changes, that transforms, that heals, that restores over your lives in the name of Jesus Christ. You are listening to me right now, and you're a young lady. You are in front of your computer. You have not been able to do well in your exams and you are very concerned. I pray for you right now that the wisdom of God will come upon you in the name of Jesus Christ. You are a mother and you are worried about your child who has been having so many problems in life. You are not sure what to do because he's so drunk, he drinks, he's a juvenile delinquent. I pray right now wherever he is that the power of God will come upon the anointing, will capture him and bring him back to Christ in the name of Jesus. I pray also, Lord Father, for this young man who is listening to me right now in the United States of America. You are Indian by culture. You are born Indian, but you've lived in America for some 22 years now. And you're not sure what is happening to your life. You have broken up with your family. Your life is in disarray. And you're listening to me right now by a mistake. I pray that in the name of Jesus, that the hand of God will overshadow you even right now. And everything that you have lost, you're going to regain. You just lost your job. You got a letter now that says you've lost your job. I pray for you. Listen, God says you're going to be recalled back to your office. And for every one of you who connects with me this evening, I pray in the name of Jesus, your life is transformed. Enjoy your birthday. Be blessed in the name of Jesus. Listen, write us, send us an email, call us, and share with us the marvelous testimonies God is doing wonders in your life. In the name of our Lord Jesus Christ, amen.